Swagger Gaming here today. I'm going to be giving you guys a little life update of what's been going on with me lately. I know I've been away for a month once again, but I'm going to be telling you guys what games I've been playing. And I bought some a couple of Switch games while I was away, and I'm going to share that with you guys. Oh, and before I even tell you guys um, what's been going on with me, oh my god. You guys, while I was away, I witnessed, with you all witnessed, the Pokemon game everybody was asking for. But, you know, there is some people that is in their feelings because, you know, it's like they talk about the graphics and all of that. It's not your typical Pokemon game. Well, you know what? I am freaking excited. Oh, my God. When I first saw the trailer... I was so freaking excited. My my face was literally like this. Like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I was just happy. What I saw in the trailer was amazing. They're going to have online multiplayer. Every Pokemon game has online. Well, you know, this was in the 3DS version and stuff like that. The Pokeball was like... $50. I ordered mine. I want to get both. I want to get Pokemon. Let's go Eevee. She's my favorite. If I had to choose between Pikachu and Eevee, I would have to choose Eevee, of course. So, um, I want Pokemon. Let's go Eevee. And Pokemon. Let's go Pikachu. So, basically, it's like your typical Pokemon Go that was like on the app. Um, to be honest, when I first got that, yeah, everybody was excited. I was excited. But it... To me, it kept boring quickly. I don't know. It was kind of hard to get um, Pokeballs. In order for you to get Pokeballs, you had to spend real money. I wasn't about to do that. But um, from the trailer, when I got so far, um, a couch co-op, then later on I found out that you can um, battle against people online. The Pokeball that they were going to sell separately, that is your key to capture your Pokemon from my... Um, my understanding, if I'm right. If, I, if I'm wrong, correct me in the comments, guys. But that is so me. I will spend $50 to get that Pokeball. You guys, just be freaking happy. We've been wanting a Pokemon game for the Switch for the longest. I'm, I'm just like, I am satisfied. I am totally satisfied with this. But you guys know, we all know that is a the real, the real adventure Pokemon game coming out next year in 2019. Probably towards the end of 2019 but these two and it's coming out in November a couple of more months oh my god I'm I am too hyped for this I'm so excited the oh my god the fact that you can just take your little Pokemon with you on the go with your switch I've been taking my switch on the go like almost every day well I'm just starting to take my switch with me at work so, guys, I tell you, I can't wait to get my Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. I'm going to get Pikachu, but my main focus is going to be on Eevee because she's my favorite. So, once I get that game, I'm going to pop that Nintendo Switch in my dock on my big 55-inch TV and just start going on an adventure with my Pokemon. I'm just, I am so freaking excited. I'm very interested in how it's going to connect with the Pokemon Go app. Um, I just started back playing that, so you can transfer your Pokemon that's on the uh, on the Go app to your game, so that is very convenient. <sighs> I think I said enough. I am so in love with this game, and I haven't even played yet. But <sighs> yeah, Pokemon, let's go. I'm ready to go and get my game. <laughs> oh, in other news, guys, I've been away. I've been very very busy because. Um, I have a career that I want to pursue, and that is nursing. If you guys didn't know, um, I have a lot, a lot of experience in the healthcare field, and I'm going back to school very, very soon to be a registered nurse. Well, my next step is to be a licensed practical nurse, and then I'm going to go back to school to be a registered nurse. I love helping people. That is my dream, and it's, it's hard work, but ever since I was a little girl, you know, I always wanted to be a nurse. I always wanted to be a nurse. I wanted to make my family proud of me. You know, something that my kids could look back on and everything. It's just my passion and I like to make good money. So, um, it's not just 
only about the money. It's just about, you know, me helping people. And some people think because um, you're a caregiver or you're a nurse, you just swap people's butts. It's not about that. I take very... I mean, I take pride in what I do, you know, as a caregiver, and I, you know, I get a real connection with my patients, so that's what I do for a living. I've been, I have a lot of experience in the healthcare field, and that's what I've been doing, guys. <laughs> I've been away, um, I'm working, taking care of my patients, um, I have an early shift every single day and everything, and, and trying to save up the money to go back to school, to get my um, degree and everything, so... That is good, um, but you know, I'm going to keep you guys updated on that and everything. Once I've been on the way, I've been buying some Switch games. This was a birthday gift for a special someone. Um, this was Mario Tennis Aces, so I did get this for my birthday. If you guys didn't know, my birthday was June 25th. Um, I always loved tennis game. The last tennis game I played and I really enjoyed was on the 3DS. I also got um, the um, Yonder, the Cloud Catcher Chronicles. This game is so good. I mean, so good. Before I even think about buying um, buying this game, I did my research. This game, you know what? <laughs> I've seen a couple of uh, reviews about it saying that it's like a mix of Zelda and so other game Stardew Valley because well you, the only thing is about this game you don't have like a battle you don't fight monsters or nothing like that but you do like a farm to carry animals um you just explore you explore it's very peaceful it's very addicting I mean it was it's totally worth it it's $40 um and I also get Shushi Striker the way of the Shishido for the Switch, oh my god, when this um, demo came out on the Switch, I couldn't stop playing it. I played it a lot. I think I played like two hours or so on it. Um, finally, finally got my hands on this game. Um, I like fast-paced games, strategy games like this. It's very addicting. Um, oh, and another game that I bought that's quite interesting. Now, you, some of you guys know... I'm in love with rhythm games, especially girly type games. <laughs> so, um, I got, what's this game called? Give me a minute, give me a minute. I think this game was called Para Something Idol All Stage. It's a rhythm game that was released on Nintendo Switch for Japan only, Japanese only. And it is so magical. I mean, I love rhythm games like this. Um, I got it in my Switch, but it also comes with some cards. I didn't open it yet. I want to um, frame these cards. They're so pretty. Oh my god, this other game is so good. So good. Um, I got it off of Play Asia uh, website. No, 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 I didn't. No, I didn't. I got it off of Amazon and it cost me about like $80. But I know I'm crazy, but I just couldn't wait. I have Prime membership. So I know it's on PlayAsia.com and you can get it way less but knowing me that's how I do guys hi guys that's it for the video for today I miss you all please comment down below what games have you bought for the Nintendo Switch recently and what games are you looking forward to that's going to be coming out oh go vacation I know it was the original Wii game I am getting that it's coming out next Friday on the 27th <laughs> I haven't played it before I've seen gameplays, I've seen trailers, it's my kind of game. Um, but anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video.